Hyperbaric oxygen therapy is a safe and effective treatment for various types of brain injuries. Some of the conditions we treat here are stroke, traumatic brain injury, post-concussion syndrome, to name a few. The first case study I'm going to tell you about is a traumatic brain injury patient who suffered his injury from going 108 feet over a freeway um, to the ground and um, had a severe brain injury from it. So with this patient, he had already um, made it out of the hospital and has had a lot of therapies an adjunct with it, PT, OT, and speech, and his wife um, had found us. So they decided to start treatment with us. Upon arrival, he was wheelchair bound and could speak, uh, but kind of was a little not all the way there as far as how well he wanted to speak and um, comfort with his balance and walking. After we first started out with a spec brain image uh, that diagnosed the brain injury and how the extent of the brain injury. And then we did a round of treatments. By the time he finished that round of treatments, he was walking with a cane uh, and doing tremendously better. We did a scan on him to see where he was at and he had significant improvement on that scan. So then we did another round of treatments. Uh, during this round, he continued you to get more strength, balance, uh, fine motor function, speech, and all that was improving for him. So we repeated the scan upon discharge as well for him. And he, again, he had significant improvement and his quality of life was forever changed since having treatments with us. Another example on different brain injuries that we treat here are stroke patients. This one in particular was a lady that had a stroke and she was a traveling missionary prior to her stroke. After she had her um, stroke, she had, was left with severe side effects from it. She was unable to know her name. Um, she was unable to write. Uh, she was unable to speak properly without saying random things like, you know, bird, cat, dog, when she's trying to say, how are you? The, the word connection was not there. So her husband found us online and decided to proceed with treatment with us. We did a brain scan of her as well, like we do on all of our brain injury patients, and we, she completed a series of treatments. Again, just like all of our patients, they come in as patients, leave as family, and once she was done with hers, she actually was able to sign her name for the first time. She gave us one of their CDs of um, different religious songs that they sing, um, and also besides that, she was able to recognize who she was. She could hold a conversation just like she could before her stroke, and again, her quality of life was forever changed, and she was able to continue to move forward with her missionaries. Another example of different type of brain injuries that we frequently see here is post-concussion syndrome. You see this a lot in athletes, but we also see it a lot in children, especially in high school ages from different sports related injuries. The case that I'm about to tell you about is a professional water skier. She actually was doing a backflip in the air and she hit the water so hard that it blew her eardrum out. So she's experienced a concussion. Most concussions do resolve on their own with time, but this one was going on for months and after it. So then it was turned into post-concussion syndrome. She was having headaches, she was uh, difficulty thinking, she wasn't able to go to school the whole day because it was hurting her head and um, she wasn't able to do the same type of um, school work that she did before. So her mother found us online and we did do a spec scan on her as well. And she completed a series of treatments by the time that she was done, she was back to water skiing again. She was back on her honor roll. She was, her headaches were gone. Um, and now she's actually graduated from high school and she's over off in college doing well, still being a professional water skier. If you or a loved one has experienced a brain injury and would like to know some more information, give us a call as we would love to answer any of the questions you may have.